Hey YouTube, this is Mac with episode number four. Woo! Um, this is gonna be about primitive hand fishing on remote Indonesian islands. Woo! The first method that I'd like to talk about is um just digging for clams. Like the women and children, like the men don't usually do this. Uh go into parts in the jungle in low tide and they dig for clams. I mean, yeah. The second one is called a corral, which takes all the men in the whole village, and it takes two days. One day is just preparation. You take these huge leafy vines, and you tie them all together, and I'm talking like 500 feet worth of vines that they make, and you pull all, or you take all the villagers, you go out, you make it into like this big huge circle thing around a school of fish and it creates a psychological barrier like they could go through it if they wanted to but they feel they feel like they're trapped because they're used to being netted and yeah so then once all the fish get in a circle and they're close then the villagers spear them this next method doesn't really have a name that I'm aware of but you take a stick that has like a V and you wrap spider web around it and you collect maybe multiple webs and then you attach it to a kite and this method is primarily used for catching needlefish and the theory is when the needlefish attack the web their teeth get stuck in the the um, web and it makes um, like it kind of acts like a hook their teeth do. Next method is called Korakora. Kora. You take vines and you attach them to a rock. And then you make a lure out of a leaf. It's kind of cool. Maybe I'll sh show like a picture or something. Um, you attach the hook to the, the um, vine. And when it drops down to the bottom, you yank it and that yanks the hook out of the vine and then you just kind of like jig it up I guess the indigenous people of Indonesia believe that screaming and cussing and swearing at the fish makes them bite and the this is called haru haru and then they also use bow fishing, which is pretty self-explanatory. I mean, you take a bow and you fish with it, like you shoot fish. And then hand lining, which is basically a hook on a line, and you just fish, like without a rod, just like normal fishing. All right, well, that concludes this episode. Thank you for watching, and rate, comment, and subscribe.